Hey there, my mighty, mighty Pisces. What's up? Hey, Pisces, this is Renee and welcome back. This is your next reading and we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to go all about romance. What's going on? What's happening? Um, what you can expect? But we're going to take a look at Pisces love life. Okay, so let's get some energy for Pisces. Now, if this resonates, like and subscribe. Share if you'd like. If it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements. You could be um, resonating more with your other placements at the moment, right? So let's take a look at your energy. We have worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life, right? So you may be in between relationships at the moment. We also have retreat. It's time to dis disconnect from the world. So kind of step back. Let the world do the world. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, at the moment, do Pisces. Concentrate on Pisces, right? Because I feel like you're calling your soulmate. You're calling for that connection to come in. That's what I'm getting right now. I feel like what's coming in for you is definitely worth waiting for. And I feel like you're in like this manifestation mode. You're bringing that soulmate closer to you um, with every purge of your energy. Okay. So let's get some more energy for Pisces. Tell me more about this energy, please. We have Hello from Heaven. Archangel Azrael. Your loved ones in heaven are doing fine. Let go of the worries and feel their loving blessings. So I feel like your, your ancestors, your loved ones who have passed, are kind of guiding you. They're looking out for you right now. Okay? We also have gentleness. This is Archangel Sandophon. Be very gentle with yourself at this time. Surround yourself with gentle people, situations, and environments. Okay, so don't kind of judge yourself too harshly, you know. Um, let things go. Let things kind of escalate naturally. Let things go with the flow. And they will work out well. Okay, so let's get some more energy for Pisces. So we have regeneration. Yeah, that's exactly what you're going through. You're regenerating. You're going through changes. You know, this is like... The judgment card, moving out of your comfort zone into a more positive energy. So you may be re regenerating at this time. And I feel like that's what's bringing your energies higher. And it's also bringing your loved ones closer, right? We also have number 21, clean it up. So that's where I'm getting that purging energy. You may need to clear your energy in order to move forward with any kind of love connection any kind of love offer, you know, that way you can be more open to receiving the love that's coming in, your soulmate connection, okay? So let's take a look at the love oracles. What's coming in for Pisces? Message for Pisces, please. Message for Pisces. The hand of cards. Yeah, spirit is letting you know to take a chance, take a risk. You know, what is coming for, forward for you is still a mystery. It may not be shown to you right now, but it's in store for you very soon, right? But Spirit wants you to know to take a risk. To, at this time, concentrate on your healing. Concentrate on some kind of addiction that you may have. But concentrate on healing your heart so that you'll be more open and receptive to love you know and if you need to make sure to take time to talk to someone this may also be spending more time with your friends your loved ones you know you may be hanging out you may be just socializing at the moment or just having fun you know maybe you're happily single at the moment but you know i feel like this is all going to be said and changed for you there's something shocking, a surprise coming forward, something that you're not expecting. So I feel like whatever this love is that's coming forward, it's not something that you're looking for. It may be something that is looking for you, right? So let's take a look at the 
uh, the Romance Tarot and get some messages for Pisces. Messages for Pisces, please, and love. What do we have for Pisces? Okay, the helper of action. Definitely. You're blessed with many wonderful things to do. It would be great if you could take the time to make a plan first, but you probably don't have the time. So get busy. Follow your instincts and have fun. You are someone you meet is very self-assured, capable, and enthusiastic. And can do anything with a smile. Right? So I feel like someone is coming forward that is very thoughtful. And, and the word I'm getting is aggressive. So this person could be like, you know, this is what I want. This is what I'm going to have. You know what I'm saying? We also have the seven of thoughts. You've been confused about a situation in your life. And now suddenly everything is completely clear to you. Whether the truth was revealed by your angels or disclosed by a friend or discovered on your own, it feels great to be awake and aware. Feel free to ask for time alone if that's what you need, right? So I feel like you're coming into this awareness, Pisces. You're, you're really realizing what it is that you want and now you, you're focusing on how you're going to get there. Okay, we have the healer of abundance. So this is the queen of pinnacles energy. Never doubt that you can make a difference. Your creativity and ability to be innovative make you destined to succeed. It might be time to expand your career, but don't forget to leave time for family. This situation involves a person, possibly you, who's down to earth with a gift of design and decorating. He or she is open-minded and nurturing. So definitely someone is coming through here with a solid offer. Someone wants to really be seen as an asset. You know, they really want you to value their communication, their time, their presence. You know, um, we also have review and contemplation. So definitely hangman energy, right? You're, you're accomplished in a great deal in, excuse me, you've accomplished a great deal in life and you have much to be proud of. Now it's time to decide what's next. As you contemplate the past and the present, you'll get clear on your divine life purpose. Don't be distracted by conventional thinking. Be the real you, right? So that's beautiful energy, Pisces. So let's see. Let's go ahead and get some messages. What would this person say to Pisces? What does this person want to say to Pisces about this connection? Give me a message from this person, please. I know I was a distraction from your pain. Okay, I feel like this person isn't really clear about the connection that you have with them. But I feel like they think about you a lot. They can't get you off of their mind. Sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Just being near you is intoxicating. Right? I wish I could share my good news with you. So I feel like there may be some distance between you and this person. I am... Starting to understand our connection. This person feels very connected to you. You know, they, they feel like you and this person are, are very connected. You know? Um, I feel like there's some kind of situation to where, you know, there's a lot of communicating going on. I replay our con our conversations over and over. I can't stop thinking about you. I love you unconditionally. Wow. You and I were too young. You know? So and I feel like, you know, you and this person maybe just starting out in this situation. Or it could be that you're too young to really think about where it's going to go next. Um... 
But I feel like this person, they have a lot of love for you, um, Pisces. They really have a lot of love to you for you. Some cards want to come out. They're kind of flipped over here. Let's see. We have, I can't make you happy. Why do I feel so lost? I can't do this right now. I can't come to you now. I feel like there's some there's something blocking you. There's something blocking you in this person. Or this is your energy, Pisces. I feel like you may be scared to take that leap because of some kind of past energy that you've been through. I don't want to be alone. How could I ever forgive the mess I've made? I'm better with my mind than my heart. Yeah, I'm feeling like this is your energy, Pisces. I'm feeling like you're kind of caught between, you know, good things that could be happening to you and not really accepting because I can't make a decision. I, I, I feel like you've been hurt, so you're not quite sure where you're going. I don't know who I am anymore. What is going on with you, Pisces? I was hurt by you. You know, I, I feel like you're afraid. I can't express myself. Yeah, you're afraid, Pisces. You're afraid. These feelings are eating me alive. What are you doing? What is the truth? Right. Yeah, I mean, what are you doing, Pisces? Well, what is going on? Why are you closing yourself up to the good blessings that are coming? Right? Because I feel like you have angel protection. I feel like your angels are surrounding you. You know, your angels are trying to keep you uplifted. There may be the um, leap of faith that you need to take. I feel like you're very scared. I feel like you're afraid to fall into love again for some reason. You're afraid just to let go and take the plunge. Why are you afraid? What, what's going on? Tell me about it, Pisces. Yeah, look at this. Let down your walls and be open to opportunities. Ask and you shall receive. You have to let go so that something better can come. Right? I'm tired of being apart. Step into a higher vibration. Good things are happening. You know? And I feel like you've been cheated on in the past. That's what's pushing you. You know? You pushed. I pushed you away. You know? You, you're into this. You're, you're wearing a mask, Pisces. You know? Because you really don't want to show your emotions. But I, I feel like, you know, there's good things coming your way. There's good things that are happening. You just have to be more open to receiving them, you know, because, you know, you may not be aware of what's coming forward, but you need to be open minded, right? You need to have an open mind because the outcome is going to be positive. And you may not see the outcome right now, but your prayers are being answered, right? So Pisces, open up, let down your walls, because I feel like what's coming is going to be something that you are not expecting at all, right? So let's get a timeline. For, uh, no, I keep wanting to go to that timeline. I don't know why that is. Let's take a look at the tarot. Let's see what's going on for Pisces. Messages for Pisces, please. What does Pisces need to know about this connection? Okay. Yeah, we have the star. Yeah, you're healing, Pisces. But you're trying to find happiness. I feel like this person wants to bring you happiness. They want to bring you a connection. A, you know, emotional connection that is filled with happiness and friendship and abundance, right? And I feel like, you know, they want to create this situation, but they want you to have an understanding. You know, they want to 
they want you to understand where they're coming from. And I feel like you want an understanding as well because you're looking for balance. You're looking for someone who will complete you, right? And I feel like this person is bringing you happiness. This person is bringing you clarity. And they're releasing some kind of truth to you to help you fully understand that you are their wish come true. You know, ask and you shall receive. You're, you're, you're receiving a blessing here, right? You may not see the blessing. You may see it as just another opportunity, okay? But this is a blessing coming forward. And I feel like you totally understand that in the um in the future because i feel like this is definitely a new beginning for you this is something that's that, that you're going to want to act upon this is a gift this is a gift that is um bringing you happiness and joy right so beautiful energy here at the bottom look at this oh my gosh good for good fortune and change Things are going to be changing for you, Pisces. Just have faith. Have faith that, that something beautiful is about to happen. Okay? Because that's definitely what it is. They want to take action. You know? They want to help build up your heart. Build up your emotions. Okay? And they're willing to take care of your heart. You know? To complete you. To bring you happiness. Fulfillment. Healing. Right? So beautiful energy. Let's go ahead and get a timeline now for Pisces. When will this connection happen for Pisces? When will this come forward? When is this connection happening for Pisces, please? Message for Pisces. Before the end of the summer months. So yeah, that's coming in pretty clear. At the bottom, you have you are experiencing hesitation. Be clear with your desires. The time frame is within 10 months. Okay? So it could happen by the end of summer or within 10 months. But you have to be clear about your desires and your intentions. Don't be so hesitant about the changes that you're going through. The beauty is coming. Right? Pisces. You know, you just have to be open and receptive to the beautiful things that are happening in your life. Because that is what's going to determine when you are going to make this connection. Okay? Let's take a look at an uh, angel number for Pisces. What does Pisces need to know? What does Pisces need to know about his connection and their current situation? Message for Pisces. 666 reflection yeah it's time to reflect it's time to reflect and fully envision where you want your life to be how you want your life to look and where you may feel stuck at the moment so that you can release that energy right okay so reflection when you allow time for reflection you allow yourself to see where the inner shifts are needed it's time for you to look at your beliefs and ask, is this serving me or is it time for me to release this? Reflect, refocus, and readjust, right? So Pisces, your affirmation. As I refocus on what serves my highest good, I feel myself shift into my highest self, okay? So beautiful. So that's what I have for you, Pisces. So if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. If it doesn't resonate, make sure to take a look at your other placements. They may be resonating with you more at this time. And I, I certainly hope this helps you out, Pisces. You know, um, make sure to comment below. I, I really want to hear your thoughts, your comments, your, you know, how you feel about the situation. Okay. And until your next reading, many blessings to you and much love and light.